Here at Ruby's Inn, we've been welcoming people to the wonders of Bryce Canyon for over 100 years. Ever since Ruby Surrett looked at a tourist with a twinkle in his eye and said, we hope you tell your friends about us, we've established a time-honored tradition of good old-fashioned hospitality, entertainment, and home away from home. But it takes a dedicated team of friendly, hard-working folks to keep this place running, and we need your help. Ruby's Inn is looking for people to help us with our mission of hospitality. Those who care about other people, who are willing to treat each guest like a member of our family, just like we've been doing for the last hundred years, and all against the backdrop of one of America's scenic wonders, Bryce Canyon National Park. We need individuals who want to be a part of a team that will work together to present a smile and a handshake to anyone who walks in our doors. Our guests will feel like this could be their home while they're here. When you join us at Ruby's Inn, you'll experience that sense of home too. You'll have endless opportunities to explore the trails in and around Bryce Canyon. Get a little piece of good old Western living and enjoy the serenity of the landscape around you. So why don't you make Ruby's in your home for a summer, or a fall, or a winter? Well, here at Ruby's Inn, we enjoy the camaraderie, working together with all the, all the other people that work here. Well, I like Bryce Canyon. There's a lot of things I like about it. The scenery is outstanding. The hiking is fantastic. There's the horseback riding. Probably the best thing for me here is going out to the rim. We go up there sometimes and picnic. We go up there in the evening because, you know, Bryce Canyon is a dark park. So when the sun goes away, it's pitch black out there. You can't see the end of your nose, but you can see billions of stars. It's beautiful out there. I love the solitude up here. Love the people I work with. The canyons are unbelievable. Pictures don't do it any justice. You have to be here to see Breast Canyon. But it's a it's an unbelievable place. It should be one of the seven wonders of the world. Here at Ruby's Inn, we have really great weather. The skies are always blue. But you know, up here we're almost at 8,000 feet, which makes the weather wonderful because I don't think we got up to 85 degrees this whole time, this whole time. And I've been here since April. This has been a wonderful experience. We've had a great time here. And it's, a, it's, a, and it's an amazing place, it really is. It's a real good working relationship. We really enjoy working here at Ruby's. Working at Ruby's Inn, I've been here almost seven months and I feel like I'm part of the family. You know, it's just like the people I see every day, even the people that don't work in the store, people outside who work in the other areas of Ruby's Inn, it's just like family. The employee campground is, is really nice. It's, it's large. Uh, we have full facilities, uh, our water, heat, uh, electricity, and storage, uh, and it's, it's wide open. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's good. It's good. It's real close. You know, it's, it's two minutes away from work, so yeah, it, it, uh, it's, it's nice, it really is. We have a nice campground, we have a wonderful place to park our RV, it's safe. It's only a couple blocks from the store. You can walk to work if you want. We have restaurants, you can have breakfast, you know, you can eat lunch. We get wonderful discounts, and it's just a wonderful opportunity. I really like staying here. Uh, in all the places that we've worked, this is really one of the nicest employees' campgrounds that we've been in. I mean, we're backed up to wilderness. You know, we just walk. It's, it's like less than a mile walk to the rim from here. The spaces are just really, really, really wide. They're very well kept. They've, they've got beautiful landscaping here. Yeah, plenty of room. You don't feel like you're on top of your neighbor. And yet, if you want to have a party and you want to have a bunch of people over, you got plenty of room to do that. Uh, the Wi-Fi is great. Our work camper employee campground, we call it Escalante View. It's a beautiful campground that it overlooks Powell Point. 
and it's walkable distance to go to the rim to look down into Bryce Canyon. The sites are beautiful. They're very large to pull in no matter what size of rig you may have. We have a lot of uh, barbecues and get-togethers over there with our work campers. They get to meet everyone. They travel from all over the state. That They come in and it's what's fun about it is if they have their tradition and then we can even have a taste and tell. We have invite them over for luncheons, dinners, we have barbecues, that it's, it's a lot of fun. Bingo games, we enjoy a lot of activities with our work campers. We do understand that our work campers have pets and so we are pet friendly, that we welcome them to bring their little furry family members. The utilities are included. We also give all of our employees a percentage off for any kind of merchandise and groceries here on the property. You also get to go into Bryce Canyon on the shuttle for free. So we do have a lot of perks that we uh, offer our employees. So one good thing with our work campers is we do have where you work. We have the general store. You can get your groceries right here. Walkable distance to all of our restaurants, Old Bryce Town, even walkable distance to the employee campground where you guys will be staying at Escalante View. You know, there's lots of things to do around here. And what my wife and I really enjoy when working, work camping is interacting with the people from other countries. It's, we, we, we get a big joy out of that. I like meeting people from all over the world, really, because we do. I like talking to them and finding out about things that, that they do in their country that we don't do in ours and about their food. So that's the things I really like. I enjoy meeting people from all over the world and uh, we get to do that here because they come from all over the world. I enjoy the people I work with who also come from all over the world. Um, it's an expansive family. When you meet so many different people, it broadens your knowledge. And you don't get to do that in a lot of jobs. I've had many jobs in my lifetime, but this has been the place to work, the job. And I can't say I've ever regretted being here. You know, I've been here 22 years, and you get, you really do, you get an opportunity to meet so many wonderful people in the campground, in the store, in the restaurant. You know, we have, we afforded the opportunity to make the best of our time that we're here with the customers and the staff, and they are very good to work with. One of the reasons I came to Utah was because I wanted to actually see Utah, and there are more national parks here in Utah than any other state in the United States. And within a couple of hours, you can be at uh, Capitol Reef National Park, you can be at Kodachrome Basin, you can be at Zion, and about uh, maybe five hours drive, you can be at Grand Canyon. So there's plenty to do, plenty to see. Uh, if you like hiking, if you like biking, if you just like seeing the beautiful outdoors, it's expansive. It's hard to say all the pluses we have here, but all I can tell you is that if you're going to choose a place to work, think about it. And if you have an opportunity to choose to come work at Ruby's, that should be high on your list. Ruby's Inn has a long and storied history here at Bryce Canyon. Founders Ruby and Minnie Surrett first came here in 1916 to Homestead, but when they arrived, they had no idea of the beauty that was in store for them. Their cousin, Claude Sudweeks, invited them to come see this hole in the ground. And when they saw the brightly colored rock and intricate hoodoos, they were filled with awe. Ruby and Minnie started taking visiting friends out to see Bryce Canyon. And by nightfall, no one ever wanted to leave their enchanting surroundings. So Ruby constructed a lodge dedicated to serving tourists on the canyon rim by Sunset Point and named it Tourist's Rest. Here, people could stay at the serene edge of Bryce's amphitheater for days, waking up to the majestic rock formations every morning. Ruby put up a swing for the children, and guests were invited to carve their names on the large wooden doors. In 1923, President Warren G. Harding proclaimed Bryce Canyon a national monument, 
and the Union Pacific Railroad acquired the rights to build a lodge on the site of Tourist Rest. Ruby and Minnie were paid for their water rights and had to go back to their ranch several miles away. Determined not to give up, Ruby began construction on a new lodge on his property and called it Ruby's Inn. Ruby and Minnie wasted no time furnishing the new inn with all the comforts of home. Ruby used red cedar logs and pine boughs as supports for the lobby, and Minnie decorated them with leafy branches, pine cones, and Native American rugs. They built a grand fireplace out of river rock, and above the mantel wrote, Tell your friends about me. Ruby and Minnie had only two children who survived infancy, named Carl and Armida. They grew up at Ruby's Inn and learned how to work at an early age. Armida would help her mother in the cafe, and Carl worked side by side with Ruby, and the inn is still run by the descendants of Ruby and Minnie to this day. Since these early years, Ruby's Inn has grown exponentially and has even developed into the newly blossoming Bryce Canyon City. But one thing has never changed, and that's the welcoming, homegrown hospitality that lives on at Ruby's Inn. It's the legacy that Ruby and Minnie started and is carried on by every employee who works here. We pride ourselves on our hospitality because that's the lifeblood of the work here you know, getting the people to come here. Ruby and Minnie, they were totally everything for uh, hospitality, customer service, welcoming the guests to just see this beautiful area that we're at. So that's one of the main goals here at Ruby's Inn is customer service, hospitality. Um, we get tourists here that are from all around the world. And of course you need to treat them right so they'll be able to tell their friends and return back again. You know, Ruby's Inn has been here in business 103 years. You know, how many places can you think of that have been in business? That means they're doing something right. And when you have an opportunity to be part of that staff, it's amazing. Ruby always envisioned great things for Ruby's Inn. And today, we're pleased to offer so much more than just a comfortable place to sleep. At Ruby's Inn, you'll have the option of working at one of our many incredible departments and facilities with our dedicated behind-the-scenes staff. One such place is the general store and gift shop, which has long been the best place for visitors to stock up on supplies and souvenirs. From groceries, meats, and fresh produce, to Bryce Canyon souvenirs, clothing, camping equipment, and jewelry, Anyone can find what they're looking for at the Ruby's Inn General Store. There's also a United States Post Office window in the store. Ruby's Inn has had a post office since the early days when Ruby was the postmaster for the surrounding area. For over 100 years, Ruby and his family have prided themselves in knowing what travelers need, and that tradition carries on to this day. There's also the Cowboy Dining Room and Steakhouse Restaurant, which carries on the Ruby's Inn tradition of feeding guests day and night. There are horse rides available to Bryce Canyon Rim and Red Canyon, ATV rides, wagon rides, and an authentic Western rodeo from late May to mid-August. There's a fantastic Western dinner show at Ebenezer's featuring live entertainment. The Old West Photo Gallery takes souvenir photos for our guests. And the Western Arts Gallery is right next to the general store and offers a large selection of Indian arts and crafts. Across the street from Ruby's Inn, Old Bryce Town offers more shopping with an Old Western flavor from May through October. Inside the store are hand-dipped ice cream cones, bakery goods, homemade chocolates, and a gift shop. And right next door, the rock shop is full of fascinating treasures. Petrified wood, sandstone sculptures, fossils, and polished stones. There's the car care center, the RV park and campsite, and bicycle rentals. Each of these places offers a unique and enjoyable dynamic. 
Find out how you best fit into our family here at Ruby's Inn. Ruby and Minnie Surrett wanted people to know that everyone was welcome here. And that idea has grown into an enduring legacy at Ruby's Inn. It's been passed on from generation to generation and by the managers and employees who work here. Together, we make an incredible dedicated team. And we hope you'll join us in our mission to carry out Ruby and Minnie's dream of making Ruby's Inn a welcoming, comfortable, and enjoyable experience. It's just beautiful. The weather is fine. You know, I, I don't think of anything we miss in except you. So come join our staff.